As we reported last night, given assurances that it was safe to return, they would. Today they have. News that there was a general amnesty across Kurdistan, one agreed to even by the Iraqi president Saddam Hussein himself, they came back over the mountains any way they could. It was their fear of Iraqi troops, their certainty that they were about to enter the city of Salamania, that panicked them to leave in the first place. Members of the PUK, the party ousted from power in this region, have taken refuge on the border with Iran, along with their families and their troops. It will be some time before they can be persuaded to return. Though that is hard to believe in the carnival atmosphere today in Salamania, that anyone is at risk, but there are scores to settle, and some PUK members and their families may never be safe coming back. What is emerging tonight is the prospect of an agreement between the KDP leader, Musad Muzani, now the undisputed overlord of Kurdistan, and Saddam Hussein. Such an alliance would pose the Americans particularly with a dilemma. If the Kurds say yes to Saddam Hussein, what business is it of President Clinton? Michael Nicholson, News at 10, Salamania, Northern Iraq.